What a moment yesterday. The game clock hit zero. Bowling Green players are waiting for the perfect window to pour an entire jug of yellow Gatorade onto their head coach. Then they grab hold of the I-75 trophy and bring it over to the BG sidelines, a place it hadn't been in the nine years prior. Scott Leffler and his Falcons shocked the college football world yesterday when they dominated the Toledo Rockets in all three phases, winning this historic rivalry 20-7. With that said, how did Bowling Green accomplish such a feat? As 26 and a half point underdogs in the postgame presser, Coach Leffler, along with senior defensive tackle Nico Lotanen, who was on that 2015 MAC championship squad, said the night before Friday night, when they get to speak to the team in meetings and give speeches, it just felt different. When they woke up on game day, it felt different. No rhyme or reason, just destiny looking to help these Falcons break a 10 year streak. Last night, you know, and, uh, you know, we, there's all kinds of things that we make uh, this game important. We, and we're going to even emphasize it even more because um, I've got to our staff and we've got to taste what this game is. It's an awesome game. And uh, that game on both sides should always be important. But uh, last night was different. Um, it would, I, I don't know what it was. The, we always have kids speak and coaches speak and give testimonies and uh, just like, for, like I said, for the first time since I've been here, it felt right. It felt right. For me, it felt, yeah, like it felt so different. Um, I, we woke up this morning and it's just, it was a different feel than the, than the previous five years. And, I, and I, was just, I was keeping that in my head the whole, the whole day. And uh, yeah, it just felt, it felt a lot different. I don't know, just everyone's energy was just skyrocketed. Everyone was just so lasered in and focused um, more than previous years. We need uh, now. We have no excuse now. We, fed, we, we tasted it. We got a. We got an idea how it is. Now we got to go do it, day in and day out. Those uh, those New England teams, the Alabamas of the world, the Ohio States, Michigans, all those people. It is a day in, day out that you're playing your rival. That's how you practice. That's how you win, and uh, that's where we need to go. I mean, it's a it's a blessing just to you know get the W for the seniors. It wasn't really about me. I was just wanted to play hard for the seniors because the last couple of years they didn't go out like we wanted to, but we got the dub today, so it was just a blessing from God to uh, get the W for the seniors. They left a legacy, plain and simple. Uh, we haven't had that trophy in nine years, and uh, 15 years from now, 20 years from now, when they have uh, beautiful kids running around, a great wife, they've got great jobs, uh, they're going to be able to uh, get together and they will never forget this moment. And uh, that's what college football is all about, those special moments, those bonds, those unities, the brotherhood. And uh, they have something that they can walk out the door with that no one can ever take away from them. So I'm super happy for all of them.